been 50 something years, there hasn't been no change. How are there gonna be a change right now? It's the same team, same people, unless there's a real change and then we believe it. Until now, there's no change. We've seen in history, there's always a promise of changes and everything still is the same. Um, I'm optimistic that one day, something will actually change for the better of the country. But I don't think that because there's a new president now, there's gonna be such a radical change. Um, he's just gonna be one of the other puppets. There's some changes, but they're not the changes that all these people in here, Cuban Americans, are expecting. Raul is leaving, but he's still there. Fidel passed away. And the other people, the originals from the revolution, you know, are now 81, 90, and maybe uh, 100 years. There should be a new generation. And the problem that Cuba has right now is that the Cuban generation today, the teenagers and the ones that have gone to school, that they have received a good education and stuff like that, are not happy and they come to the United States. I wish I had uh, the freedom to go back to Cuba under a different government without fearing being put in prison for my political views. Time is taking over and uh, eventually in a few years because uh, it happened to all of us uh, Raul Castro won't be around and uh, and hopefully with that new generation there is a greater chance that uh, a change will happen in Cuba.